Hello YouTubers, happy Valentine's Day and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars diecast review. Today we're going to take a look at the fabulous Hudson Hornet with the headset. So before we get right into the review, let me discuss something. So while Lightning McQueen was attending the tiebreaker race along with Chick Hicks and Strip the King Weathers, Doc Hudson, a.k.a. the Fabulous Hudson Hornet, and the rest of the town's folk of Radiator Springs came to his pit lane as his new pit crew, with Doc being his crew chief, wearing this headset and re-emerging as the fabulous Hudson Hornet 51 years after his crash. And Doc even coached him. And Doc even coached Lightning in, 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 to finish the race with his eyes shut and, and find the crew that would work for him getting a lap back and keeping his head on and t telling Luigi and Guido that he's going as his professional pit crew. Mater did not say goodbye to him, which it Mater literally said goodbye to him, well, which was just an expression. And <laughs> But what do you think? Was it actually expression? Leave that in the com leave your thoughts in the comments down below. So anyhow, Doc even also told Lightning to drive in deep and hoping it would stick when the last lap drew in. And Lightning even surprised Doc by doing turn right to go left. And when Chick Hicks had bashed the king off of the track, causing, causing him to crash into the infield, and the crowd gasping, Doc saw the crash, astounded, and, and Lightning reminded the crash of Doc's on the old newspaper clipping, and when, and after forfeiting the Piston Cup to Chick Hicks, Lightning went back to help the former champion across the finish line by telling him and also telling him over the radio that one of that that the piston cup was just an empty cup and which impressed which also impressed Doc by pushing him across the finish line and and he also and Doc also kept the headset when he and Lightning went on to win three Piston Cup championships between 2006 and 2008. And that is it. So now let's get right into the review. You have got his friendly facial expression, his headlights, his chrome silver grill and bumper and mouth and on the hood we on in the Hudson logo and which is copyrighted and and on both sides of the hood we've got on the hood we've got twin H power on both sides and and on and on the left side we've got the red rims on his black wall light year racing tires and the words fabulous Hudson Hornet hence his name and the number 51 in the gas cap and the old piston cup logo and on the top we've got the headset and the microphone and a yellow number 51 on front and left front and back sides and his name and his name signature saying Hudson Hornet and on the back we've got the another Hudson logo and the 
Hornet tampos and the taillights and the back bumper. And that is it. So now let's compare them to the, the other Doc Hudson diecasts. We got the regular Doc Hudson. And lastly, the regular Fabulous Hudson Hornet. Both have the Hudson logo and the twin inch power on both sides of the hoods and the headlights and the chrome silver gray grill and mouth and bumpers and twin inch power on both sides of the hoods and but here are some differences headset no headset 51 name signature old piston cup logo fabulous Hudson Hornet 51 gas cap and here's another difference red rims silver rims which this is this die cast is in an inaccurate model compared to this ver version die cast so hopefully I'll get the accurate version of this die cast and the Hudson logo and the Hornet Tampos both have Hudson Hornet on their undercarriages which is both are copyrighted I kinda of forgot to mention the bit and that is completely it and now let's pull up some of the other other Team 95 members of 2005. We've got Lightning McQueen, his pupil, Luigi and Guido, Mac, Sheriff, Flo, Ramon, of course, this is Red Ramon, although the, although I don't have the Lightning Ramon, only have the, just the, I'm just raring to get the regular Lightning Ramon. Mater, Fillmore, this is regular Fillmore, I, which, and I don't have the Pit Crew member Fillmore, but hopefully I'll get him. And... Sarge, this is this is just regular. This is just regular Sarge, not pit crew member Sarge. But hopefully, I'll get the pit crew member Sarge. Rusty and Dusty, the Rusty's brothers, and finally, my name is not Chuck, who had previously quitted the team just before Lightning I mean fell out of Max trailer. And that is it. So what do you guys think? Which variant of Doc Hudson is your favorite? And which Team Lightning McQueen member of 2005 is your favorite also? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like and subscribe for more. Also, don't forget to leave any suggestions of which car of the past from the car collection video in the description should I review next in the comments section as well. Consider, also, consider the support by viewing and subscribing my channel. I would really appreciate it very much. I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Happy Valentine's Day! Goodbye now!